were asked to determine the indefinite integral, the directions could also state determine the antiderivative. We have the integral of three e to the x minus five cosecant squared x dx, which is equal to the family of functions whose derivative is equal to the given integrand function. In this example, I will show all the detailed steps that we often skip when determining indefinite integrals or determining antiderivatives. First, notice how we have the integral of a difference. The integral of a difference is equal to the difference of integrals, which means you can write the given integral as the integral of three e to the x dx minus the integral of five cosecant squared x dx. From here we can factor out the three and factor out the five, which gives us three times the integral of e to the x dx minus five times the integral of cosecant squared x dx. And now looking at the antiderivative or indefinite integral formulas on the right, notice the integral of e to the x dx is equal to e to the x plus c, which means three times the integral of e to the x dx is equal to three times e to the x plus c. But because we'll also have a constant of integration for the second integral, let's put plus c sub one, where c sub one is some constant. And then we have minus five times the integral of cosecant squared x dx, which we can see from the formulas is equal to negative cotangent x plus c, which will give us minus five times negative cotangent x plus, again, let's not use c yet, we'll use c sub two. And now we'll simplify, and so that our final antiderivative only has one constant, we will let c equal c sub one plus c sub two. If c sub one and c sub two are constants, c sub one plus c sub two will also be some constant. And therefore the final antiderivative is three e to the x plus five cotangent x plus c. And we often identify the indefinite integral or antiderivative using a capital letter and the integrand function using a lowercase letter. So in this case, the antiderivative big F of x is equal to three e to the x plus five cotangent x plus c. So this is the family of functions whose derivative is equal to three e to the x minus five cosecant squared x. And let's go ahead and check this. Big F prime of x is equal to, the derivative of three e to the x is three e to the x, and then plus the derivative of five cotangent x is equal to five times negative cosecant squared x, giving us minus five cosecant squared x and then plus the derivative of a constant, which is zero. Notice how big F prime of x is equal to little f of x, the integrand function, which does verify big F of x is the antiderivative, meaning the family of functions whose derivative is the given integrand function. And we see a family of functions because the constant c can be any real number, giving us an infinite number of functions. I hope you found this helpful.